think that's why it failed. Oh, no, here's a blue dot. What's this? Uh, is it a car? Please be a car. Let's see. Ah, uh, oh, it's the sleeping guy again. Damn it. So maybe it did fail then. It must have failed. Because I keep finding blue dots, but no car. Are you, are you driving around, or what are you, uh, where are you at? And that's the second time I found the key. Uh, no, I just found it again. Like, it's about... 50, 20 minutes ago I found it and I just found it again so maybe the car thing is kaput but I'll try to find the car again after this wait your bike's still here why aren't you driving your own car instead of you're stealing cars and driving them <laughs> that's funny <laughs> But don't you get cops a lot for stealing the cars? Hmm. Okay, so you made it inside or you're loading, I see, because I can't invite you, so, okay. Set this up again. If it lets me, let's see. It might have a timer on it still. I forget how long. Might. Oh, yeah, it does. Can't do this. It's stupid. It has 25 minutes. I don't know. Uh. Tag. No, not tag. <laughs> um. Hmm. No, I don't want to do that. That's silly. <clears throat> I think I have to stop now, I guess, and just try to find the car, or just, uh, go and see what's going on with those guys about that, but I'm not really interested in that, the drama. Mm. Yeah, it's probably because I told them off, because that's one thing about me, if someone gets smart with me and they try to make me mad, I'll just tell them off and then block them and get rid of them. Which usually makes them mad because they want you to, you know, pay attention to them and fight them and not stop. So they have you as a plaything kind of thing. You know what I mean? Yeah, but I don't, I'm not, I don't fall for that. So I bet I've made lots of people mad that are trying to do that to me. Because usually what I'll do is I'll be like, oh, you're like that. And then I'll be like, okay, bye. And I just block them. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Mm. Hmm. 
One sec, uh, making a phone call, see if they answer. Still trying to find the blue dot, though. Mm, no answer, of course. Nope, no answer. Okay. What's that crew that you're in there, Flint? What is that? It's, oh, a Resident Evil crew? That's cool. Are you still in one of mine or no? Oh, that's good. Cool. Thanks. Okay, I don't know. I don't see any blue dot. I can't find one, oh well.
if I can sell a car now. I'm gonna go check, see if I can sell. Fifteen minutes, I still have to wait. Fifteen minutes. You know what I mean? Like, he's not a good guy. Oh, I don't want to know that. I don't need to know that. Okay, go ahead, tell me whatever you want. It doesn't matter to me. Wait, he lives in a prostitute club? Okay. Ugh, alright. Yeah, it doesn't matter to me. I don't like him. So... Yeah, it doesn't really matter about how a person looks and stuff. It's how they behave and treat others that really matters. You know what I mean? So. Yeah, you have to be a nice, respectful person. Like myself, I can get into bad behavior if I hang out with the wrong people because I have a tendency to be very sensitive because I like to be that way so that I can feel how people are feeling so that I can treat them as they need to be treated to help them feel loved that's what I try to do right and I believe in God so and I don't believe in God according to any man or woman I believe in God according to what I think I ought to be thinking I try to talk to God personally you know what I mean but I like to try to share it with people you know, but I don't want to associate with people who are afraid of being themselves or allowing others to be themselves. Uh, you know what I mean? Because I'm the kind of person that thinks it's healthy for people to explore who they are and be able to do so with other people within a reasonable way, right? So be careful, be peaceful, be nice and all that. I don't like it when people are rude and bully and rough and they don't give a shit and they're afraid to be honest and all that crap. I get, I get rid of those people. So, And a lot of people have a tendency to decide to be selfish because they're afraid of getting hurt. So you have to watch out for those people because it's kind of understandable. They don't want to get hurt, but then they become maybe too selfish to really be able to associate well with other people. You know what I mean? And then if you end up associating with people who are like that, you end up picking up those bad habits too. So you have to be careful, right? So, And I don't even, you know, that's just the way I've always been, but I have had a tendency to try to be nice to people because I'm trying to help them be better people, which is kind of presumptuous of me in a way because it's not like I'm perfect. But I was hoping you know that when I met people and I was trying to help them that they would be thinking along those lines too to meet people and try to help them and if they're thinking that way then in a way what can become is like friendship which is a healthy thing because you're trying to help each other as friends do not some bullshit of pretending to be friends but selfishly not meaning it because you're afraid to get hurt that kind of crap I don't want to be around that's like childish in a way it's natural for children to behave that way when it comes to the real world you know what I mean so we should just put that video on YouTube 